Okay, so whenever we're asked to uh, find uh, an inequality or draw an inequality onto a graph, um, always uh, draw the line but without the inequality in it. So instead of x is greater than or equal to 5, always draw the line x equals 5. Um, if it can be equal to it, um, it's a solid line. If it can't, if it can't be equal to it, um, it's a dashed line. Okay, so it's x equals 5, and I'm going to draw a solid line. So where does x equal 5? Well, x equals 5 here, and here, and here, and in fact, anywhere along that line. It's just a vertical line up, and that's the line x equals 5. Um, and it's really important to remember which way around it is. Whenever you have um, x equals something, it's always a line from top to bottom. When you have y equals something, it's always a line from left to right. Okay, that's the line x equals 5. Um, but it asks us to mark the region in the inequality with an r. So it's either going to be to the left or the right of this line. Well, it says that x can be anything that's greater than or equal to 5. So x could be... 5, 6, 7, 8 on this graph, okay, because obviously it only goes up to 8. So anywhere this side of the line is absolutely fine, so I'm going to mark my R there. And actually sometimes the exams ask you to shade it in, so I just shade in that right-hand side of the graph. Um, sometimes you shade in what you don't want, um, and if I was shading in what I didn't want, obviously it would be on the left-hand side of that graph.